Well, hello again. We're starting off with the sun because the uh, filters were already on, so since it was set up this way, but those uh, sunspots, the 2706 seems to have faded. It would have been on the uh, left hand side over here, but it appears to be gone. So let's go out and take a look at the sky here. There we go. We'll upright the tripod. So yeah, it's a pleasant surprise to even see the sun today. The last few days have been uh, total cloud cover where the sun couldn't even cut through it. And even so, this morning, it was a solid gray blanket up there, but, uh, but a couple hours ago, it all changed. So, anyway, the sun's over here in the southwest, and uh, not much to see. About the only clouds around are this uh, set right here. So even though I thought I was going to get shut out for full moon rising tonight, we may just have a shot after all. So anyway, well, here's our documentation on Sunday, April 29th, 2018. It's about 2.45 p.m. But anyway, it looks like we'll be able to get some uh, shots tonight if all this uh, holds up. So the full moon rising for me would be 8.57 p.m. Should be 100% full. And tonight, Jupiter and the moon and Spica should all be pretty close together. Now they say Jupiter should be close to Earth, um, probably about 400 some million miles away. <laughs> But hopefully with it being closer to us, we'll be able to see a bigger Jupiter. So for folks who have a clear sky, I hope you're able to watch the uh, evening stars and planets tonight. All right, good viewing to you guys. Bye for now.